Hope you're having an amazing Sunday. Happy Father's Day to everybody out there. Hope you guys are having a great day. If you're a father, if you're listening and watching this video, I appreciate you guys. And to my dad, happy Father's Day. I'm gonna work on getting him his gift, whether or not he wants it or not, that's okay. But I wanted to talk to you guys all about our idea of when it comes to groom prep. So the main thing as a second shooter like myself is whenever it comes to groom prep and I film the groom getting dressed, the main thing we look for is a big window. It could be anywhere. Normally, whenever the groom's getting ready, he's getting ready in someone's house, whether it's his mom's, their families, or his bride's families, whoever's house, wherever, a hotel, anywhere. And this is just an example. I really like this. Like, this is a really cool area. We didn't shoot groom prep in here, but I just wanted to show you guys as, as an example. But basically what we do, I have a 50 millimeter lens on my cameras, not on this camera though, um, but we normally get the groom or whoever is the groom squared up. So we're flat with the window and the videographer, a little bit of everything, jacket, tie, cufflinks, watch, just everything that they're gonna be wearing for the day. Get it from multiple angles. We like to do straight on first, just so we have a good base. But then sometimes we'll get the groom, if they're into it, to do it one more time. And then we'll go from, we'll go over there and then shoot this way. So it would be like a side profile. And normally we will like silhouette them with the window or we'll expose for them in the window and shoot from like a kind of cider angle, not side profile but yeah just wanted to talk to you guys right through that but this this room right here is really cool like look at this it's like a museum in here like it's really cool stuff